Police say these people are targeting homeowners in Macomb County. How they're ripping off unsuspecting victims. Tonight, a family's desperate search to find a loved one who failed to pick up his wife at the hospital. And we're weeding out the fact and fiction over the new marijuana laws just passed in Metro Detroit. You're watching 7 Action News, always taking action for you. Uh, we begin tonight with a warning for homeowners in Macomb County. A trio of suspected home invaders is making the rounds, even breaking into the home of a top official. 7 Action News reporter Julie Bonovich is in Clinton Township tonight, where photos snapped by a neighbor may help get them off the streets. We might never have known what these bad guys look like, but we do because of a mother who lives nearby and her son. The pictures are very clear and close up. They capture two women and a man moments before the trio robbed the home of Clinton Township Supervisor Bob Cannon. You know, I'm sad this happened. I'm distraught that it happened, but I'm very thankful that my wife and daughter are safe. His wife had just left the house right before noon to do some volunteer work today when the three smashed in the back window with a crowbar. They stole all of our jewelry and uh, a lot of our money. The only reason police have these photographs is because of the quick thinking of the Morgan family. It was quite terrifying to see three people coming away from a house and not knowing what could have happened because it could have been somebody in there. They knew the three people looked out of place and jumped into action, snapping pics with the camera. This is just like some of those things you might see this stuff on a TV, but oh man, I wish they could have had a better camera so you can like uh, see those things. I was like, oh, I have one. So I just went to go grab my camera, switched out the lens real quick and uh, turned it on and then I just start recording from there. It appears the three were going door to door, knocking to figure out who wasn't home before stealing what wasn't theirs. Bob says he's grateful for his very watchful neighbors. Clinton Township Police are asking for your help. If you know any of the three people in those pictures, please call them. Reporting from Clinton Township, Julie Bonovich, 7 Action News. All right, Julie, pretty clear picture.